I am Anil Kumar sharing with you an excellent question on data analysis. The question here is, the figure below represents fish population in thousands over the past five years. The year over which the percent increase was greatest is from 2000 to 2001, 2001 to 2002, 2002 to 2003 or 2003 to 2004. I would like you to pause the video, answer the question and then look into my suggestion. And don't be surprised if you get a wrong answer. This is one of the top 10 questions of the list in multiple choice questions. Now let us try to understand what is percent increase. Right? This is very important to understand. What is percent increase? So if I want to find percent increase, then we have to do final value minus initial value. divided by initial and then multiply by 100. So that is the percent increase. Keep that in mind. You can actually pause the video now, answer the question and then look into my suggestion. That will help. Well, if you just see the diagram, it seems as if from 2003 to 4, there has been highest increase. Well, in numbers there could be, but we are interested in percent increase. That is important to understand, right? So the emphasis here is to understand the term percent increase. Now let's do some calculations and figure it out. Well, these numbers are in thousands, so, so we can say the value at 2000 is 5, 5000 actually, and in 2001, it is 10,000, right? So what we can do is we can also work with 10 and 5 since thousands will cancel out. Is that okay? So, so we'll work, just work with 10 and 5. Okay. So the increase here is, or if you want, you can use thousands also. Anyway, so it is final value. So we are doing the year 2000 to 2000. 1. Now in this case final value is 10. So we'll do 10 take away 5 divide by initial value which is the population in 2000 which is 5 times 100 and that gives you 10 minus 5 is 5 5 divided by 1 is 1 and you get 100% right so you get 100% here. Now, you can do calculations for all the values in between, but I'll, I'm more interested in doing the last one here, which is these two values. So from 2003 to 2004, the final value is 45, okay, minus initial value, which is 25, divided by the initial value, which is 25, times 100. Is it okay? Let's use the calculator. 45 minus 25 is 20, right? So 45 minus 25 is 20. When you divide this by 25, you'll get less than 1, right? Which is equals to 4 over 5 and times 100 will give you less than 100, which is 80, right? So you, what you get here is 80%. Do you see that part? So what you really see is that don't go with this gap. It does show maximum increase. But when you're talking about percent increase, it's a ratio of change over the original value. So over the original value, 2000 to 2001 showed a 100% change from 5 to 10, right? So that becomes the highest percent increase. And that is what you need to understand when you go for some tests like GMAT, SAT or something like that. So keep in mind that percent increase is final minus initial divided by initial times 100. 
I'm Anil Kumar. You can always share and subscribe my videos. Thank you and all the best.